it lived up to its hype. We knew Samson Dowda was going to be in that lineup. He had just come off a win. He was third at the Olympia. This guy is as hot as any commodity in the IFBB right now. Dave Palumbo here for an RX Muscle news update. The IFBB Prague Pro has let out the pre-judging, and it was a doozy. I got to tell you, it lived up to its hype. We knew Samson Dowda was going to be in that lineup. He had just come off a win. He was third at the Olympia. This guy is as hot as any commodity in the IFBB right now. Turned out, Samson was in the middle. Michael Crizzo next to him. Rubio Mascara, who is the phenom who just turned pro yesterday at the amateur NPC Prague Pro, goes right into the pro ranks. He's right up there next to the likes of Crizzo, Samson Dowda, and Nathan DeAsher on the other side. It looks, according to the way the judges have these guys lined up, that it's going to be Samson Dowda probably first, second place Crizzo, but this show is not over. I have to tell you, you know, and once again, I'm judging it from video and, and photos I'm seeing. I'm not there in person. But Rubiel Mascara, as I said yesterday in his NPC win, this guy is for real. He has got the most mass on stage. He makes Samson look small on that stage, which is very, very hard to do because Samson has got a lot of muscle on that body. This guy, Rubiel, is going to be a force to be reckoned with in the IFBB. I think he's just getting his feet wet now. I personally thought he was better than Crizzo. Now, I'm not saying that Crizzo wasn't harder than he was. Crizzo is always super crazy ripped. But I think from behind, I think Rubiel has everyone from behind, including, including Samson Dowda. So what the judges do later, I don't know. I have a feeling it's going to be Samson Crizzo. Mascara and Nathan Diasha. And that is saying a lot because you have to understand that this guy just turned pro yesterday and he's going to probably knock off the likes of a Nathan Diasha who looks really good here in this lineup. Um, as you can see in the uh, call outs here, these guys are close. And, you know, we'll talk about this in the wrap up of, of the final conclusion. And I'm sure Chris and I will discuss this on Heavy Muscle Radio on Sunday night. But Samson Dowda is an incredible athlete. He's got every bell and whistle you'd want in a pro. He's tall, he's broad, he's got round muscle bellies, but I still have yet to see him bring the level of conditioning that I would like to see from him where he's just shutting the door on these guys. There should be no doubt in anyone's mind that this guy wins this show, and I think the door is open. I think Crizzo's close because of his conditioning. I think Mascara, with his size and conditioning, are close to to uh, Samson, and I don't think they should be. I think Samson has got to really, really work in this offseason on refining his physique, learning how to condition himself to the point where it's lights out when he steps on that stage because he's got the tools to shut these people down like that, and we haven't seen a shutout performance. Had he brought that to the Olympia, he would be Mr. Olympia right now. But it looks right now like it's going to be Samson and then Crizzo with Mascara and, and Nathan Diesha fighting for third and fourth. We'll know more later after the finals. For now, I'm Dave Palumbo with an RX Muscle news update.